Hey everybody, welcome to Viperhead TV. Thank you so much for joining me today. Today I'm going to share with you a little recipe for uh, firming eye cream. Uh, it's good for us younger girls that have those you know, days where our eyes are a little bit tired and worn out from a long night before. If you're a little bit too stoned and your eyes look a little bit droopy and you want to make sure you look hot. Or if you're a little bit older and your skin's, you know, starting to, to you know, appear your age and you want to, you know, appear the age that you feel on the inside, I have the perfect thing for you. So it's a, a firming eye cream that utilizes a variety of different really nice natural um, elements, which I really appreciate. Um, first, you're going to take one and one fourth teaspoon or tablespoons of cannabis oil, one fourth cup of green tea, a quarter teaspoon of citric acid, a tablespoon of rosehip oil, one tablespoon of sweet almond oil, a quarter teaspoon of vitamin E, one teaspoon of emulsifying wax, one drop of carrot seed oil, and three drops of lavender oil. And um, those are going to be your basis. You can throw in a couple other things if you want to substitute lavender oil for eucalyptus or whatever, you know, whatever you feel most comfortable with. If you, uh, lavender oil is a very soothing, um, a very soothing herb. So if you want something a little bit different, you can always substitute. Um, same with if you want like vitamin A instead of vitamin E or something, whichever works best for you. Um, if you would prefer, I mean, you can use THC oil, CBD oil. A lot of people use hemp oil for this specific recipe. From That's actually where I got it from, a website that was advertising it with hemp oil instead. Um, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna take the tea and you're gonna brew the green tea and you're going to fill two medium saucepans half the way up with water. You're going to place a glass bowl with the spout in each pot on medium heat. And um, you're going to then take the wax, the rosehip oil, the vitamin E, the almond oil, and you're going to mix it all together in one, in one little um, bowl. And then you're going to take the green tea and the citric acid and put it in the other. And you're going to heat both of them until the wax is melted. And then um, once both products are at about 130 degrees Fahrenheit, you're going to mix it together. If you mix it together when it's too hot or too cool, you might not get, um, it, it might not mix as well. From what I read online, if you mix it when it's too cool or too hot, I can't remember, but one of them, it like doesn't, the, the wax starts to, um, like pull away from the oils and you get a really uneven mixture. I think this one is too cool. Make, it would make more sense. But um, I hope this helps a little bit. It's um, I use it myself. It's very, very fun uh, firming eye cream. You don't get any effects from the THC, obviously, because when you use THC topically, you don't necessarily get any of the psychotropic effects. But um, it does help with the inflammation. Like I said, if you have tired eyes, or anything like that, it really helps with that. Um, you know, reduces the amount of puffiness in your eyes. Um, I have noticed that my black circles around my eyes too, especially when I'm really tired, they've also diminished. So um, that's something that I really appreciate. And I also have a little recipe that I use to make um, firming cream for my legs. And I use a little bit of vitamin E. I d don't even measure with this one, I just kind of do it at my leisure. Um, I put in a little bit of vitamin E, a little bit of lavender oil, a little bit of cannabis oil, and I mix in uh, about a quarter cup of green tea, and um, I just, you know, lather that on my, after I shake it up, and I let it sit for a little bit. When I get out of the shower, I just put it a little bit on my legs, a little bit on my stomach area, and it helps keep my skin really tight and nice looking, so. Um, I really would love to hear some feedback from anybody that uses it, so. I use it, I don't know if it was working for me or if it's, you know, something else that I'm changing in my lifestyle, but, you know, I would really love to hear from anybody else that decides to make this, if it works or not. Well, thank you so much for watching Viperhead TV. Until next time.